Hi everyone, thank you for joining me. Today's video is going to be quite different as I'm going to be talking about a new product that I'm going to be adding to the base camp and be leaving it here. So I hope you enjoy this video. It's just going to be running through this great product that I'm going to be using at base camp to help secure my stuff and sort of protect all the valuables I keep here because there's so many sentimental and expensive pieces of kit that I leave at the base camp so sometimes it is quite worrying when I do go home and I go home for a while to edit videos or meet friends or just for like Christmas just now um, and yeah it's quite worrying leaving stuff because in the past I've had problems where things have been stolen or our old camp got vandalized and ha and got completely destroyed and when you've been when you spent a long duration building something it's really soul destroying and yeah all your hard effort and work just gets completely ruined so this item i feel will be really beneficial and just have that sense of security I guess I feel like I can build a lot here and leave stuff here without feeling too worried about it anyway I hope you all had an absolutely lovely Christmas and a happy new year so we are now in 2021 which is absolutely crazy so here is my wonderful item that I'm going to be talking about it's still in the box actually so it's like Christmas again and um, yeah, I'm just gonna talk through what I've got here and how it works and all the specs and things like that. Just in case some of you are interested of in doing the same. I know a lot of people have base camps and homesteads and farms and things like that. So this would be really beneficial for you. So this is the Rio Link security camera. And my plan is to kind of attach it one of the trees around here or even inside my bell tent and just keep it so it keeps an eye on all my stuff like I said I've got a lot of expensive and a lot of sentimental things that I leave here and this is a, a really remote place like miles and miles away from society and civilization people do tend to come through here and you get people on walks and things like that and um, I have had people actually come to here walking through and like looking and being at our camps, mine and my dad's and um, he's had things stolen from his so it is quite worrying. So hopefully this will solve the problem and keep a lot of my stuff safe. I also really want to use it for spotting animals so there's a lot of pheasants and deer around at the minute and a lot of birds so I'd love to maybe set it up and have it as a sort of trail camera sort of thing so I think that would be brilliant just to get some night shots maybe leave some food out and have this set up and get some shots of animals that are in the area I think that would be really cool anyway this is fairly new to me I'm still getting the hang still trying to get the hang of it and learn about it so what I'm going to do is set it up and then I think after this video I'm going to try find a really good place to set it up permanently but also be able to take it down if I wanted to take some shots of animals and wildlife in the area. You can see it's tiny and it's really light and portable so I think that's a really nice feature. It's not a huge camera that you've got to lug places and it's going to be really heavy. Obviously at a base camp it doesn't really matter about weight. To help with waterproofness it also comes with this little sock that goes onto it and it's camo which is quite nice so it blends in. The camera does come with various attachment points so I've got screws here, I've got a strap and this is the mount that it fits on so I can strap it low down or high up a tree um, depending on what sort of position I want. So this is the Rio Link Go, which means that it can run from 3G or 4G instead of having to rely on Wi-Fi network. So this is really ideal for here 
because there is obviously no Wi-Fi but it also be perfect if you're in a place with limited Wi-Fi and it would just solely run off 3G and 4G. Sometimes here I don't always get 3G and 4G but most of the time I do get 3G so there we go. I feel this is great, I was so surprised by this but when you connect it up with your phone you can see live images so I left it here the other night in my bell tent and left it just inside and it was great because I was at home and I could look at the bell tent and see here which was really nice and see what was going on. This would be really a cool aspect if I was say sitting in my bell tent and I set this up down down into the woods more and I could see animals and that walking past it would be it's just a nice thing. I found that really amazing that you could have the camera set up and see the live images and the live footage from your phone when you're miles away. So the camera itself is 1080p HD. It's got a six times digital lens. It has a high quality speaker and microphone. You get instant email alerts and notifications. So if you set it up on your phone, you can detect if there's movement near the camera. The camera includes night vision, which detects up to 10 meters. It has a rechargeable battery included. And I will mention in a minute that you can actually rig up a solar panel to it, which I have actually got, which is great. So I can keep the solar panel attached to it and get constant charge to the camera. I can actually save the footage and keep it on my phone. So if I did get a nice shot of a deer or a pheasant, or I got a shot of somebody taking something from the camp, then I could save that footage and keep it with me. It has a built-in siren, customised voice alert and a setting where you can get an instant notification or email sent to you. I'm now going to insert the memory card and the battery inside the camera, so just boost it up now. So it comes with a free Vodafone SIM card. rechargeable battery Now moving on with the Rio Link solar panel 2. It's a tiny little solar panel which will fit alongside the actual camera. Same again, this is really portable, this really lightweight and it comes with a really long lead so it doesn't have to be right next to the camera like I said. It can be quite a distance away. This comes with a mount as well for the solar panel to attach to so that can just attach there and be put somewhere where there's a lot of sunlight so ideally this should be facing south all day and getting loads of charge so you can charge your camera frequently so it comes with a four meter connection cable so you can have your camera set up somewhere and four meters away you can have the solar panel charging up because like here for instance, my camera would f be facing north depending on where I put it but it ideally would be facing north towards the bell tent and I'd want the solar panel around the other side of the tree or facing the sub southerly direction so that 4 meters gives me a chance to do that and play around with it. And yet again this is all waterproof so I can leave it outside all year round and it's not going to be affected by the weather. So if I didn't come to the bell tent for a while and I just left it here with the solar panel I know that I would get power charged to the camera to keep it running and I know I wouldn't have to keep coming back and forth with rechargeable batteries. 
so it allows me just to have one battery and I just want to mention there is so many cameras that the Rio Link company make and this one is the Rio Link Go which is one of the few that do the 3G 4G connection the other ones I think you do need Wi-Fi to run them so thank you so much for watching this video I really appreciate it my ideal plan for 2021 is to get to 100k so if you haven't already I'd really appreciate if you subscribe to my channel so that is literally just clicking the red button uh, on, that's on my channel page and or under this video thanks again for watching I also want to thank all my lovely wonderful patrons for making this video possible and letting me be able to buy some of the amazing gear that I do have to make it possible to stay out I am on day six I think of a camp out and I wouldn't be able to do it if I didn't have the right equipment, so the wood burner and my tent and the clothing. So I want to say a huge thank you to my patrons. And also thanks so much to Moses, a lovely guy who made this wonderful Girl Outdoors hat for me. And this is keeping me warm in these cold winter months, so cheers for that. The link to the camera and the solar panel will be in the video description if you are interested. You may have a homestead or a base camp or you may like watching wildlife or you might just want to keep it at home so if you are interested I will leave the link below